So hey guys, I just want to bring you back. So I'm asking this other guy about missions and he's asking me to go get a creature. So I want to show you guys this part. Yep. Okay. So find a tribal member. From planet whatever so let's go find this if I'm tracking this mission we should be good it's way over there oh, that's not it Huh. Says find a tribal member from planet Kendra. Where's that thing at? Gotta be in this area somewhere. There it is. So I need to abduct a tribal member. Oops, sorry. <laughs> hmm. I need two things. I need to return home and get some energy. Can I make it? Oh, I can make it, then we'll go to him. Keep having to recharge. Recharge. Okay, now I can get stuff. Basic cargo hold. Energy pack, those things are cool, but I wanted the atmosphere generator and stuff. Getting there. Okay, goodbye. Later on I can go further, but right now I can't. Yeah, I got a reward. Okay, goodbye. All right, and there's several other missions you can do as well, like uh, abducting citizens, abducting creatures and plants, destroying infected stuff. Now, what I want to do is show you guys next one more um, thing here. This is what you're going to be doing quite often um, is terraforming planets. It's really fun. So what you want to do is you want to get that terraform in the middle. Now, early early on in space, you're going to have to buy things like uh, this atmosphere generator or atmosphere vacuums, those kind of things like I just threw on the planet to lower. To, this one will raise the atmosphere, the one I just threw down. Um, because as you can see on the left side, the, the ring is at the bottom. So I need to get it towards the middle. So you got to terraform the terraform. So most planets are going to be T0. So you got to go to T1, T2, T3. And as you advance those, you're going to um, be able to put more stuff down. So more, put more colonies down. So you're going to throw one more atmosphere generator down. That wasn't enough. So you're going to be able to put more colonies down. You can have up to three colonies on the planet that you terraform from nothing that you colonize. Now, um, what you do is you throw plants down. So you need to throw a small plant, a medium plant, a large plant down to stabilize the ecosystem, ecosystem before you're able to put um, the creatures on. So now, as you can see, I have it stabilized with the plant. So now I need to put two herbivores down. So I've been collecting these guys. You can abduct them from other planets, um, habited planets, non-habited, just put creatures on it. So there's two herbivores, and I'm going to throw one carnivore down. 
And as you get further up, you can get things like um, creature tweakers. So you can you can design your own creatures and stuff, and it'll give you five of them. And you can also get a, uh, a sanctuary planet that you can just have creatures on. And you can have up to like 50 on there. Anyway, so the spoiler alert here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get to the center of the universe. So if you don't want to see what happens when you get to the center of the universe, I would stop watching here. But if you want to see, please continue watching. So what I've done is I've got Interstellar Drive, I think, five now. So I've advanced far enough where I've been able to buy. Um, interstellar drives when you get closer to the center of the universe the drive distance short shortens anyway but you need the five so you can skip a lot of this stuff and get there quick and i'm going to show you guys i may stop along the way so but i want to show you guys the whole route because i'm going through the grox territory and i've already done this part where you discovered the grox and got that achievement and stuff i don't care about that what i care about is, is flying through as quick as i can i have a couple of recharge or one recharge thing if i need to recharge but what I'm going to do is, uh, if I need to, I'll find an inhabited planet and some other um, species, and then I'll just buy a recharge from them. But that's the Grox right there, so I'm already there. So, I just want to get out of here. As you can see, the green, I, as long as it's green, I can fly through there. I don't want to stay in their territory alone. They'll keep fighting me. I just got to fly through it as quick as possible. And you see all that dark red, that's all the Grox. Now, one time when I was playing this game, um, I started, like, wiping out their planets. And you can do that. You can start trying to take their territory over. And if you wanted to eventually, maybe you could wipe them out. I don't know. It's a constant battle, though. You're constantly having to fight them. Because when you take one of their planets, they're going to keep trying to take it back. So, but right now, all I'm trying to do is get through here um, as quick as I can. As you can see, the circle, the tan circle, keeps shrinking. So, as you get closer to the center of the universe, that distance to the planet you're able to go is going to keep keep going down and as you can see I just repaired a little bit I used uh, one of those things to give me energy or repair I think it was energy but uh, these planets even though they look like you can hit them sometimes it's because of the angle they might be further down and further up so you can't get to them and as you can see I'm losing uh, I'm losing other ships those uh, allies I have with me I don't really care about them right now I just care about getting where I gotta get as you can see I'm back in the area where I can't move really annoying so I gotta get out of here and try to do it a different route because that route didn't work so I'm gonna get out for a second so now I'm out of their territory so they're gonna leave me alone for a minute but that route didn't work so we're gonna have to try it a little different because I couldn't hit any other planets that way so let's try this again so we're gonna just kind of blast through here as quick as I can you see them in their territory again gonna make it though I will make it just taking a break for a second <laughs> I gotta kill this wood I gotta recharge it's only me left <laughs> I lost all the ally ships this is really hard to do though because you gotta hit the right ones and then they look like like I said look like you can make them but you can't make them all the time so really annoying just gotta get through them in there are breaks here where there's no um, rocks so you can kind of get out of the planet range. You see, there you go. Now I'm out of their range. So they should leave me alone here because I'm outside of their territory. So this is where I can take a break. But it's really difficult to get in there. Um, especially with that little low circle there. Here we go. Just going to keep going. I just click as quick as I can. And just keep passing up the planets. I don't even want to stop on them. You just want to keep going. As long as the green keeps appearing, you're good to go. If it doesn't, you have to go back. So you can see I just recharged a little bit or repaired. I need a repair. I'm getting beat up. Yeah, they're trying to kill me. They're trying not to let me make it. I see a planet that's out there range, though. Are we going to heal right here? Come on, use it. There we go. A little repair. So now I'm getting closer to the middle. Like I said, this is crazy, guys. This thing trying to get in here is really, really difficult. You can do it, though. But Interstellar 5 is the furthest you're going to get, and that's where I'm at right now. I'm just trying to go around here. We're trying to see how far I can go to the sides. As you can see, I can't make it in there. It's really weird. It looks like you can, but you can't. So we're going to have to go this way. So odd. All I gotta do is make it there. I don't care what happens after. They can kill me afterwards. 
And there's a planet that they don't own in the middle there, a little safe zone. Look at that. I can make it that way. We're getting there. We're almost there. So like I said, spoiler guys, if you don't want to see this, turn it off. But I am there. So now I'm just going to zoom in. And I got an achievement for making it to the center of the galaxy. And we are going to meet someone at the center. And I'm probably not going to talk through this. I'll just let it play out so you can hear what he says. Greetings, my friend. You have traveled very far and overcome many obstacles. Along the way, you have encountered many of your diverse, far-flung siblings. Precious few of them will make it this far. Your heroic efforts have proven you deserving. Worthy of advancement to the next level of your existence. The universe you inhabit is but one of many, countless worlds, unseen but yet connected. Your creative efforts have not gone unnoticed. Indeed, they have spilled into these other, unseen worlds, just as your world has been enriched by them. It is now time for you to join us. Join us! <laughs> no, just kidding. It's not scary. Indeed, the times they they are good. Really, really good. Some of you may ask, who is this mysterious voice who knows so much and possesses such great powers? I'm glad you asked. There you go, guys. That's it. And I'm giving the Staff of Life. Now, what the Staff of Life does is, it's like, I think there's 36 of them or something. I'll show you guys in my inventory. And what it does is it will not instantly, but very quickly terraform a planet. So you drop it on there, it'll raise it from T0 all the way up to T3 in a matter of, like, 10 seconds or 15 seconds or something like that. It's pretty quick. So put animals on there, creatures for you and everything. So, But there you go, guys. I just want to show you guys the center of the universe. Hope you guys enjoyed that part. Um, there's much more. I'm still playing the same map and weeks later after I recorded this. And I uh, hope you guys enjoy Spore. If you haven't played it before, it's a really cool game. It's only 20 bucks. The I got it on sale. I got uh, all three packs together, the two add-ons. But if you got to buy them separate, they're 20 bucks a piece. So the cute and creepy pack is also. So thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time.